I've raised the question about why is it that if you remember Giuliani walking with that dust mask on his face from the World Trade Center covered in dust and the World Trade Center had just flopped, both buildings had flopped down and he stood up and George Bush stood up and he became America's mayor. Uh, he used to be the district, the attorney general for the Southern District here in New York. The great big picture of him on his on the wall over there in the Brooklyn uh, courthouse, uh, Giuliani. He was he went out to the mobs. He threw mobsters in jail. He broke up the mafia, the Cosa Nostra. What happened to Giuliani? What happened to him? And. Last week, while I was off the air, he was someplace in the Republican Party down in Washington, D.C., and his hair coloring, he was, it must have been hot in the room, his hair coloring, the dye on his hair coloring began to run down the side of his face, and uh, it was just a, a joke of him. Uh, making this illogical case for Donald Trump. So, I, I mean, I raised the question as to whether or not Donald, uh, 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 Rudy Giuliani is gay. I, I know his wife. See that, see that black stuff running down? I guess people dye their hair. I mean, if that's what you do, that's cool. I don't, I don't, I don't dye mine. I, I, don't, I don't have a whole lot to dye, quite frankly. And Giuliani doesn't either. <laughs> But look at that stuff running out of his face like slop, you know. And what kind of cheap hair dye would you put on it? It can't be just for men. <laughs> or just five minutes. That stuff is supposed to, supposed to run like that. It's supposed to stay put. You know, supposed to, if, if, if you're going to do that, I, thought, I would think Giuliani would have enough money to go to a hairstylist. You know what I'm saying? Or any professional jobs, right? And, and go to a boutique. And... And they they do it they dye them up you know put that put a Al Sharpton does Al Sharpton I, I need to turn <laughs> I need to turn Juliana over to Al Sharpton's hairdresser in fact I'm gonna call Al up hey, Al <laughs> Al could you please recommend your head hairdresser to Juliana <laughs> well, I mean come on I, you, you never seen Al Sharpton's hair run like that oh yeah no you ain't no Al's cool. <laughs> Al, I don't know who Al Sharpton. I should have asked. I don't know true. That this is absolute truth. I think it was uh, Princess Lewis. Is that right? Said that her cousin or somebody was Al Sharpton's hairdresser at one point in time. Right? You don't know. <laughs> I'm looking at her son right now. He said he don't know. <laughs> well, maybe Princess. No, no, somebody. Somebody in the church used to be uh, used to be a relative of Al Sharpton's uh, uh, hairdresser. I don't know who that is. Anyway, I want to find out who Al Sharpton's hairdresser is and turn that person over to Giuliani because Giuliani's stuff was raggedy the other day. So I, I'm, a, I'm a, I was figuring, I said, well, maybe, maybe, maybe is is gay. I think, you know, because a, a few years before, before Trump became president, Trump and, 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 and Giuliani were dressed up in drag. If drag, if you don't know what that is. Well, I ain't got time to tell you because you... No, Giuliani and Trump were dressing up in drag. And that's Giuliani, that's, that's Trump. Now, he sniff, he's sniffing. Oh, Lord have mercy. Hide the children. I should have told y'all how to hide the children before I, before I went down this road. But, Mr. Engineer, if you can move the, the one that's in the bottom right-hand corner with Giuliani with the blonde wig on and Trump with the red, he even had on a red tie to end. This is before, before he came president, Right? And it looked like, can you get it back up, Ms. Inya? It looked like on this one that he's going out to Giuliani's breath. This is, Donald, this, is, this, is, this is Donald Trump, everybody. This is Donald Trump and Giuliani. This is Donald Trump, everybody. <laughs> I, in fact, you know, why don't, why don't Trump tell Giuliani who his hair? Because Trump got a bad mama jamma of a hairdresser. You ever see that boy's hair? Good Lord. Woo! That boy got a hairdresser. But he make Al Sharpton hairdresser look like he got polio. And Mr. Mr. Engineer, move the, oh, because there's another shot. Can you, can you bring it down? I want to see that shot where Giuliani got on that wig. Yeah. And Trump looked like he'd get ready to kiss him or something. This is sick. You know that? that, that that's, that's Giuliani with lipstick on. 
And look at that eyeshadow. Lord have mercy. Look like Marilyn Monroe. And Trump act like he's really getting into it. They're playing drag. <laughs> this ain't, this, these, these are publicly known pictures, right? Don't become a, you know, a threatening me and send me lawsuits for libel and all that kind of stuff. But I'm wondering if Bill Barr is, is gay also, right? I'm trying to figure out why these attorney general, why these people, I know Jeff Sessions wouldn't go for that. Trump tried to get Jeff Sessions to jump the broom, and he wouldn't do it. You know, Jeff Sessions from down in Alabama, he's history now. He ran for senator of Alabama again, got the living daylights beat out of him because Trump whooped his behind. Uh, called him Mr. Magoo, too. <laughs> but, you know, um, I, um, I'm, I'm trying to figure out if, if Bill Barr is gay. You know, because, I mean, he, I don't know if somebody say he looks like he's gay. Uh, well, what does a gay person look like? Ellen DeGeneres, Rachel Maydow, <laughs> Don Lemon. <laughs> Bill Barr does not look like Don Lemon, does he? He looks like Harvey Weinstein. You know Harvey Weinstein. <laughs> I read a report the other day. That Harvey Weinstein, they've got him on special watch down at the Metropolitan Correctional Facility. I think he's going to a federal prison too, right? So he don't commit suicide. At least like they said, that boy Jeffrey Epstein. Epstein ain't committing no stuff. Yeah, Jeff, Jeffrey Epstein down in, in Argentina somewhere. Y'all believe that? Talking about Jeffrey Epstein killed himself in that Brooklyn Metropolitan Correctional Facility downtown. Hey, hey you believe that. Got to be out your mind. This is a bit of a news blog we do, looking at spiritual wickedness in high places for the most part, making uh, some observations about it and giving people a biblical foundation to the way of interpreting rather than have uh, uh, Sean Hannity or Laura Ingram or Janine Pirro or Anderson Cooper or Rachel Maydow or Don Lemon. Uh, Rush Limbaugh interpret what's going on in the world. You come to me and I'll tell you based on what the word of God says. They'll just give you their worldly sinful view. But the man in report will tell you what God has said, whether to say yea or nay, whether to go or to stay. You'll be like led by the word of Almighty God. Come to the man in report on a daily basis to interpret the spiritual wickedness in high places because there's plenty of it that's going on. And so I am he, I'm the Lord, sir, James David Righteous Rebel Manning, and I'm here to serve you with news and information.